this is Logan Wells with Dream Guitars, and I have a real incredible guitar in my hands today. This is an OM-R from Joel Michaud. Um, this particular instrument has Amazon Rosewood back and sides, um, Master Moon Spruce on top, and as you may have noticed, some slanty frets. Um, it's got a multi-scale setup, 26 inches on the bass to 25.4 on the treble, um, which makes that an excellent dadgad guitar. Like right now. Um, it can also handle C tunings handsomely, and you can tune it right back up to standard, and it's still great as well. Um, we noticed on the top, if you look inside with an inspection mirror, you can find that it's been signed by Joel Michaud, um, serial number 86, and below that in quotation marks, it says, all the fixins. And um, here to tell you, this is a three course meal indeed. Um, it's got a bunch of extra features on it um, beyond the multi-scale setup that really make this an exceptional instrument. Um, mm, what a good guitar. Let's get into it, okay, so. As I mentioned, Moon Spruce on top, which I am such a fan of. Um, that means they harvest the wood when the moon has drawn as much sap as it can, if you will, um, out of the wood so that it is already um, pre-aged, if you will. Um, moon Spruce tends to have extra power and smoothness to it, and this guitar is certainly proof of that. The rosette is segmented. We have uh, rosewood here and here, and we have these two blocked out sections um, of what I believe is some sort of paginated material, um, or patinated, sorry, material. Um, I'll need to figure out exactly what that is, so check out the listing to get some more details there. Uh, you'll notice we have gold Evo frets throughout, which is uh, such a lovely thing. Um, they're not as hard as stainless steel, so you don't get that tinny stainless steel sound but they last a lot longer than uh, silver nickel um, frets do, so you don't have to worry about doing a bunch of fret work on these guitars, um, which is great because you're gonna wanna play this particular instrument a fair bit, I dare say. Um, additionally, um, this instrument has a classic combination of arm bevel and rib bevel, which we will get to, and a sound port here in the upper bout gives you a little more me in the monitor for the player. Um, especially, let's actually check out this arm bevel, it's kind of squared off here, sort of like a, a green field, and then as it terminates up here, it uh, becomes more of a Ryan-style bevel where it just elegantly and organically blends into the regular bindings, which is also happening here on the back in reverse. So we have that smooth Ryan-style terminating in this squared off. Um, little corner here. And of course, all of the miters are perfectly executed. Such a good guitar. And we have this nice black center strip here as well. So this is the Amazon Rosewood. But we will get back to this in a moment. Let's get back over here. The fretboard, as I mentioned, multi-scale, 26 on the bass, 25.4 on the treble. It's got a lovely setup on it. Um, as you heard, this is in Dadgad. Um, and it, it takes that tuning fantastically well, um, but I was in standard just before that and um, very, still very uh, quick, crisp, lively, um, very energetic. This is a really sweet guitar. Definitely a good finger style instrument, um, but I'm sure this thing can handle just about anything you threw at it. We have Goto 510 tuners here at the headstock, um, gold with ebonoid buttons. And we have a dramatic, curvaceous um, volute here, which um, you very much will, you know, you'll know when you, you sock up against it in first position for your hand. Um, good for orienteering as well. Oh, additionally, speaking of orienteering, um, we have lots of lovely brass um, side dots here, which I'm a big fan of. The neck, um, it's a medium thickness C profile. Um, it's, a, it's a little chunky actually, uh, which I am such a fan of, uh, very round. Feels great in hand. And let's get back here to this gorgeous rosewood. So very, very straight grained um, Amazon rosewood. It's so straight, uh, at first glance, you might think this is Indian rosewood, but in fact, it is not. It's in fact much nicer than that. Really good looking stuff. And this super straight grained um, rosewood is very stable. It's gonna continue to be stable for years to come. You don't have to worry about um, the fragility that comes with very dramatic figuring. This is here to stay. And so here we are at the side um, with again that sort of, um, uh, not quite a micro bevel, but it's a, it's a slimmer bevel than I see on a number of guitars. 
which is just lovely. This one I'm a big fan of. Um, I don't like having that angry red line on my ribs from playing, and this, this helps mitigate that a lot. And of course, yield soundboard. So if you are looking for a modern guitar, um, aesthetically and tonally and play feel wise, you know, ergonomics and creature comforts, this Michaud OMR is definitely the one for you. So please do give me a shout. Happy to talk to you about this guitar. Cheers. <laughs>